So now I've got my class notebook created. You can see it appears in this uh, little window inside Teams. Probably not a huge amount of space for you to work in. So you can go to open in browser and I'll open it up full screen. Alternatively, from the class dashboard, now that it's been created, you can go straight into the class notebook from here. And I'll open it up full screen so you get the full benefits of using class notebook. Now, every student has their own section. And it's a bit like a student exercise book. Every student can only see their own section, but the teacher can see everybody's. And this is where they might take notes. They might do some homework or some classwork in here. And the teacher can just stick the head over the shoulder of every student just using this interface. Um, and then you can mark it and reply back to them. So it's a great way to keep all the content together. This teacher also has a content library. So you might put things on here like uh, your lesson objectives um, or maybe some some rich text and some resources in here as well. Really easy to use. You know, you can just uh, go to edit in browser and just start typing into this notebook. Now, there's some really good teacher learning tools in here as well, such as Immersive Reader. And this is where students or staff can personalize the way that they see uh, the content on the screen. So I can go to view an immersive reader. And you can decide on the text and the background color. It'll strip out all the distractions from the page. It will play the speakers. And if I go to the text preferences here, I can change the visibility. So I can change the background color, I can change the font. So if you've got a student with dyslexia, I can change it to Comic Sans and a high visibility background. So they find it easier to see the screen. And that will remember it for every class notebook that they go into. You've also got some uh, grammar options here where I can turn on nouns, verbs, adjectives. And it's got some evidence behind it that it, that it helps improve reading comprehension. So it's a nice tool to have. Um, one other thing that uh, you might want to be aware of is this picture dictionary. So if you click on a word, it'll give you a picture of what that word is. And you can also even translate documents. So if you've got international students or if you're a language teacher, then you can choose your languages here. So I could choose Chinese, translate it by word. So I click on a word, translate it to Chinese and actually play it through my speaker when I press the play button. Or I can even translate the entire document. So that will personalize it per student when they log into this and it will remember their settings.